Hello there. Are you an MEP engineer who does mechanical, electrical, and plumbing design? Do you know there are tools that can help you make your design fast, accurate, and in line with appropriate codes and standards, thereby giving your clients the most professional service they deserve? Take a look at these 12 apartment building, for instance. All right, so this is the apartment building. It's on four floors. The ground floor is a car park. All right, so this is floor one, floor two, floor three. And what we want to do, so this is the uh, plan view. What we want to do then, you want to have a riser that's going to take water to all the other spaces connected to that duct without losing pressure if there's a simultaneous use. All right, so one of the first thing we want to do is um, we need to count the number of fixtures that, that are there. So we can just do this, go into our view tab and look at our view configuration. And let's, let's have it, okay, two vertical views there. All right, then I can just make this one a 3D view. To make it easier to just look at okay so what are we so we want to concentrate on this so one of the this is the pipe one size the riser this is the riser one of size since the floors are typical can you see the floors are typical floor floor one two three are typical so what i'm going to do now is i'm going to copy the floors okay just copy these floors so that i can you can be clear what i'm doing that's what i'm trying to do here i'm going to copy these floors so let's i'm going to take this as my first floor since they are typical i'll take this as my first floor and i take this as my second floor all right Remember the car park is below, okay? So what I want to do is I want to size this, this riser. So what I can do so it can be clear is let's just take in this one, go to our properties tab, and say let's make it say forty thousand, okay? So all right, so it's oh, so it's looking more like a pipe. Well, we have all the floors covered now. So what I'm trying to I'm, I'm showing you this to, you know, have a pictorial view of what I'm trying to do. So this is the riser that I want to size. I want this riser to be able to distribute water to these three fixtures on this floor, this floor. And this floor without pressure loss when there's a simultaneous use. So what do I do? I just count the number of fixtures on the three floors. That's one, two, three. That's three baths. That's one bath here, one bath here, and one bath here. One basin, one WC, one basin, one WC, one basin, one WC. So what I can then do is I'll just go to my Syntogen MP Design Toolkit. The Syntogen MP Design Toolkit will help you do this without any problem. So the wash and basin, we have three. That's three there. WC, three. So we have already three there. And then the baths also, three. We have three, then I just click on my calculate button. So what will be my riser size? The size of my riser will be what? 32 mm. I can just then come to my drawing, go back to my drawing. So I know that this riser is 32 mm. So I can just come here to the plan view and look at this. This riser is what? 32 mm. So I'm just going to change this to what? 32 mm. Simple, easy peasy. This is, you can do this and more with your Syntogen MEP design toolkit. Size your pipes appropriately. If it's your um, uh, electrical, it helps you with your electrical, uh, your load distribution, your lighting layout, your power distribution layout. It takes uh, half the work off your neck. If it's your HVAC, it sizes your ducts for you. So the Syntogen MEP design toolkit helps you design mechanical, electrical, and plumbing system fast, efficient, and accurately. Now, if you would like to learn how to do MEP designs from scratch, or you want to upskill and design more accurately, join me in my MEP design webinar, where I show you how I can take you from novice to expert, or from experience to spectacular. See you there.